So there is a new music video that's pissing people off from Kelly Kumalo, and uh, basically in this thing, she she has what right here? You know, she has people of the flag in her new music video called Maweni or something like that. So I saw an article when I was browsing Facebook, and I thought, hmm, okay, this is a very interesting article. And in this article, they actually just pretty much go to this is the article right here. I know maybe you can't see it in full detail. So let me get you a little bit of, of a shot in a little bit. So right there, so you can see the, the article from Briefly that actually came out talking about this. Now in the music video, uh, she has a couple, like a, a, a heterosexual couple and so forth. And um, after... Okay, so she has uh, them in that video. But there's another shot that I want to show you that comes from that video is that she then has them in the video. They go on to do exchanges, you know, fluid exchanges like over here. And, you know, we don't want to be describing things and all that entire jazz. And so I thought, let's talk about understanding what the Bible teaches and why people reject it. And if people want to reject it, fine, you can reject it over there. But then don't push me to rejecting it. Because that's just, you're just a bad friend. Or you're a bad Facebook friend. Let me unfriend you quickly before. <laughs> am I even friends with you? <laughs> At that point, am I even friends with you? It's the actuality show with the daily Christian commentary if it's the first time. Over here. Be sure to check out some other videos that are down in the pinned comments. Am I going to do holiday stuff? And yeah, I'm probably going to just chill after a while. But there's always something to talk about. And I have a tendency of if a story passes, I just don't talk about it. And so that's why I'm just going to keep for a few days. And then I'm probably just going to go <laughs> the 1st of January. Then I'll come back. But right now, very easy videos and stuff like that, that you might be seeing, or stuff that you might be seeing. And when I say stuff that you might be seeing, it's the likes of this particular article that I'm talking about. So, briefly made this article, talking about this thing. That's how I actually got to see this, while scrolling on Facebook. Now, and this here, uh, this story here, of Kelly having this agenda inside there, it's kind of pissed off people online a few people are kind of reacting and stuff like that but i wanted to talk about a certain topic around that i'm not talking about that you guys know my position on that uh, this is one group of or community that personally even if i met them on their way like they're going straight to hell i would just not say anything like if they were just going because they're very different kind of people they, they just even the way the bible talks about it in romans chapter one, that's when you kind of get the mindset around it. I don't talk about nothing else except their sexuality. That's it. They don't talk about nothing else. They don't talk about policies. They don't talk about doctrine. They only care about changing people's mind about what the Bible says. Now, I want to just lay this out here. You see this book. It's not a suggestion book. This is a family rule book. So the, the rules here, they tell us who are part of this family christians what we follow and what we believe and what we uphold and so if i was watching a christian and they started talking about this in a certain line that goes contrary to what this says i'll be very careful around that person as a matter of fact i might even distance myself because I'm not about to have you corrupt my mind about my father. You see, we have a father in this household. And in this household, he dictates what is right, what is wrong. He dictates what I believe, what I don't. He, he dictates. When I say dictate, I mean that precisely. Okay? Yes. He's not going to tell me to come and attack you. That's not it. You, you've got the wrong, <laughs> you got the wrong book. Or you're talking about the wrong church. Or you're talking about the wrong congregation, okay? This book will not tell me to come and attack you. What it will tell me is to distance me from you because in our household, 
we are very strict on how we portray ourselves. Image is everything. Now, when the vid, when the entire trend that came out on Dogos of Sambo and Kelly Kumalo came up, I mentioned something in that video. And it was particularly about values. And I said, there are values in the Christian community, and Kelly doesn't uphold them. And then now she does this music video showing she does not understand the values that this is presenting. You want to do that, do that. But then don't come over here and want to, to play church. We don't play, the, we don't do that. Here. here we don't do that. Here we have very, you want to be on this side of thinking? No, no, we don't play that. And I made an example of that when I displayed Ndogozo Bambo's Instagram. And I showed, look at the image she upholds. She's not out there showing herself a certain way. She's not out there half naked. She's not out there put, uh, doing whatever she wants. She's not out there doing things for shock value because she understands the importance and representation that she has to uphold, which is why even in Ghana she was recently recognized. Now, I don't know when I was going to do that video, but I had intended for that video to be separate. So if you didn't see, there was actually a report that Dogozo has just been awarded recognition for her work, okay, her Christian work in, in particular. And so this brought me back to this point. This community is about values. This community, it's about the rules of the house. This community is about what the father has put forward. And there is no child in this community that comes to turn kids in the household against their father. If the father says this, I'm following the father. I don't know you from a nickel. I don't know you from a hair on my head. If you try to turn me against my father, we have a problem. And I'm not going to be here brushing emotions. That's why I say that particular community is one group that even if it was going straight into it, I would just be why? I'll just leave them because they have they have laws, they have um, they have laws around them. They are the one group of people that the Bible says something about that have a movement of pride, and it's literally called pride. And so, I cannot. I have never seen people who are ex murderers out there busy. Yeah, ex murderers pride movement support us. I've never seen that. You know, when the Bible labels something a certain way, you know, we kind of like right there. Now, I'm not dismissing what they feel. No, 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 no. I'm not dismissing that. But your feelings are not God. Right? You must be very clear about that. Feelings are not God. But when you, there is a problem when your feelings become God. You feel this way. You feel this way. You feel this way. Right? And so that's not God. At the end of the day, the father who has labeled out, who has laid out this particular, you see, you trying to change my mind about what this says doesn't change this. So which means, I might change my mind. I might change my mind to agree with you, but I have not changed this. This doesn't change. So right here, it shows you why Kelly should stop trying to fit into the Christian your nice songs, you can keep your nice songs to yourself, just go sing that over there. Trying to win against gospel musicians, coming out here angry at gospel musicians. Don't play those games. I saw even November was doing that. I'm not even publishing that nonsense. It's just a pile of nonsense. Okay? You want to be against the father's rules? Go ahead. You want to play that game? Go ahead. But don't try to turn me against him. I know him. Oh, I know him. And so, which is what is happening right now. We have pastors that are just completely going against God. They're going against what's written here. And they want everybody to agree with them. I just thought to, talk, to come back here and remind you guys about that. The, the book, you see this, this is not my head. This is not my, my thoughts. This is the Bible. This is the manual that the Father has published for this household. If you are a part of this household, this is what we follow. You come down here trying to change my mind. You are a bad influence. I should have nothing to do with you. 
you are Satan with devil. Mm, you are the devil. They even told you. Maybe I should tell you <laughs> without, without mixing words. I have no business with anybody that wants to change my mind about what the Father instructs. You are a danger to my being. I'm siding with my Father before I side with you. Who are you? I don't know you. Let's be very clear on that. And so, me, I don't do touch and touch and paste, you know, copy and paste, <laughs> touch and paste. I'm, I'm not, you feel like this now, I must copy that, those emotions and paste them into my, no, my, the Father dictates. So I wanted to remind that. This is what I meant when I said Christians have certain values that they portray. And so, you see, Kelly can't help but portray the values that she upholds, which is self. You see, her putting that in her music video, it's self. She's talking self. It's what Kelly thinks. You know, so there is no father in heaven instructing you. You see, like there was a time when I used to do the news set. You guys would remember I used to put the earpiece. I used to put, what is that earpiece? <laughs> I used to put the earpiece and I used to say, you know, we listen to instruction from heaven. Yeah, you know, I, it, it's, it's literally what we have here. When you have the Bible, you have instruction from heaven on how to move. On every single thing. So this year is just a reminder. It's just a bit in emphasis on on that particular point. You see, the values that the Christian body holds, you don't hold. Stop trying to fit in here. We're not doing that here. Yeah, we don't we don't play those games. Here. Self does not rule here because I still have to answer to the Father, and I'm not about to be here brushing up your emotions while ignoring what the Father says. You are crazy if you think I'm going to do that. You, you crazy. You, you crazy. You're a crazy one. You going against him? I'm sorry, I'm not playing those games. The reality show you daily Christian commentary video. In this household, there is instruction, and the father tells us the values we hold. And yeah, so I'm not changing nothing. Nothing. Not a dot. Not a tittle. The Bible says what the word has gone out to fulfill, it will come back having accomplished it. You want me to go again? That? You crazy. It's Ricky. Y'all tell me your thoughts and I'll see you on the next song. Y'all be good.